Well, I've been in crop insurance for over 28 years now. And um, what drew me to crop insurance was my father, really, uh, because he was uh, a foreman for a fertilizer company. And during the summer times when I was young, I was able to go ride with him at work and drive the Caterpillar with him. And those were just the coolest times for me, great memories. Uh, but the best thing about it was being able to see my dad work and connect with the farmers and see how they interact. I knew right then and there that's what I wanted to do. So crop insurance kind of fell into the mold on that. So I took advantage of that. Well, the most notable time for me in helping out a grower was really during the 2020 wildfires that we had here. Uh, it was so devastating for our growers here up and down the state of California. The overwhelming concern that they had uh, not knowing whether or not they're going to be able to get through their lost time, uh, not knowing whether or not they're going to be able to pay their loan debts. Uh, but knowing that they had crop insurance and they had our agency being able to work with them, walk them through the crop insurance policy, and most importantly, reassure them, letting them know that they're going to be all right. So my message to Congress is really to support the 2023 Farm Bill and strengthen the crop insurance program. The farmer is the backbone of this country. Federal crop insurance for most growers is the only effective safety net out there for them. 